Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, so I am back once again after a long long time. So guys, this will be the part 2 uh, of my video series on how to create a, an app just like Uber. Alright, so, uh, so let's get started. So guys, as I, uh, I have already created the project in Android Studio, alright. Uh, so this will be our Uber app. Uh, so th this will be the main activity so I will first of all uh, set up the main activity where we will get the number of the user and then we will register his number to the uh, database so uh, before uh, starting let me sh tell you that we what we will cover in this series so basically uh, we will uh, use the android studio all right and then we will use firebase api for android and we will also work on google maps api all right and we will also look at google places api all right so uh, it will be uh, an interesting series in, uh, and hopefully you will learn something maybe you will uh, implement the concepts which you will learn in this series all right so first of all uh, i have to change the constant layout to relative layout all right so what we will do here so guys this will be our project and it is showing an error so guys what we will do let me relative layout and we will erase that so in this video i will uh, create a project in firebase all right so let's uh, create a project in our firebase so so let's go to the firebase console and here uh, i will click on go to console all right it's uh, taking uh, some time here so guys uh, these are my already projects so i will create a new project and what we, uh, we will do we will uh, write the name uh, uber all right and let me select my country as pakistan so guys if you have not already subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel i will be uploading a lot more videos all right so guys our project is started so now you have to click on add firebase to your android app in here you need to copy your android package which you can get in your build.gradle and here you can see or you can also uh, see the package here com.example.uber.uber all right so we will just paste that and we say our nickname of application as uber and here we need sha1 all right so how we can uh, get that in android studio so here click on gradle and if there is nothing to show you have to uh, refresh and here you go to uber app in android and click on signing report all right and here you will get your sha1 of your application so just copy that and paste that here click on register app so in this way you will uh, register to the google uh, uh, services so you have to now you have to download the google services json so it's as i have already so what i will do I will first of all delete these 
and I will download it again and so I will just copy that and I will click on continue so what we will do we will uh, paste that in our project so go to project view and in here you have to paste that in your app all right so now what you need to do you need to copy that and paste it now again we go to android and you have to click here and paste it here all right and another thing we need this line of code and we will open this module and let me uh, remove the constant layout dependency sorry we need we will add this at the end of our file so now i will, I will click on sync now so the project will synchronize and it will give us maybe an error i let's see so now we will click on finish so now as you guys can see we have this uh, mm, we don't have any error so guys we have successfully created a firebase project and included this that project in our android application all right so guys in my next vi next video tutorial i will implement or i will develop the layout of our main activity where the user will be able to write his number and he will be able to sign in or sign up all right so guys please if you have not already subscribed to my channel please subscribe goodbye